Welcome back everyone to another video on the Karting Tips channel and today we're going to be reviewing some footage from the archives. That's right, this was an arrive and drive race from a couple of years ago and we stumbled across an annoying driver in this session and the driver is in cart 23 just up ahead in the yellow jumper and it's safe to say he was trying to give me a hard time, certainly made things interesting because he had his own style of defending which we'll come and uh, analyze throughout this session. So here he goes a bit deep. We try and go around the outside, but he just nudges me out there. And uh, just reviewing it once more, we go around the outside, he gets his shoulders out there. And it was this move that sort of triggered things because he knows that I'm there now. So he's gonna try his best to throw everything at this to try and keep me behind. You can see he's weaving uh, left across the track there. It's a, quite a tight track at the Villaggio karting circuit over here. So there's not much room for overtaking. And I sent something on this lap, perhaps heading into the second corner. I can maybe send it down the inside over here, but he just closes the door on me and we come together. Just reviewing it though, he brake checks me initially heading into the corner, which slightly catches me off guard. But then midway through the turn, you can see the gap opens up, which is what I'm going for. But look at his steering wheel on the right hand side. He's already turning left, deliberately trying to block me there. Two will never go into one. We come together and uh, well, he just gets bumped out to the edge. I put my hand up in the moment. Maybe I was a bit too aggressive, but you can see we get a nice run through this corner. Again, trying to go down the inside, but he once again squeezes us out. And you can see we get a nice exit, good acceleration through the second hairpin turn. We can draw slightly up alongside him. My nose is certainly there, but he just squeezes us out really aggressive in his defending. And uh, this is getting quite annoying now because we're going for our clean uh, overtaking moves, but he's been quite aggressive and uh, certainly defending the hard way. So now on this lap, it's two laps stuck behind the driver. We want to get past him ASAP and we can bank on him not being consistent. And that's exactly what happens here because he goes very deep into the first hairpin turn and we just sweep right the way around the outside. But we're not finished there because in cart 20, I had a bit of a problem through the session. The seat was moving. So I decided to change the go-kart take cart number 19 and uh, get on with the session. So towards the back end of the race, we caught back up to him and he's going to be more determined than ever to try and keep me behind. He's probably going to be as aggressive as possible now and try and throw all of the tactics at me. And I'm just going to have to try and find a way around that. We're not too close yet, but heading uh, to the back end of this lap through the left hand turn, we're approaching now. We get a good exit through here, trying to go around the outside, but he just cuts across over here. Once again, trying to fend us off there and reviewing it once more, we get a nice exit. We can try and put the cart to the left hand side of him, but he just sweeps across there. And that was so not right, as someone would say. But now on this lap, I'm more determined than ever to get past him. And I can bank on him, perhaps going a bit deep into this first hairpin turn. So we back off over here, let him go deep. And then we're going to attempt to switch back line because he tries to sweep across us there. We get the switch back down on him. We lean on the left hand side on exit there and we get past him just to review the overtake once more. He goes deep into the turn and now I'm going to anticipate him to do that same tactic, which has come right across me uh, in the turning point. And you can see he does exactly that. So I just back off. Go for the switch back line, the space opens up nicely. I get a good acceleration. We're right up alongside him here. And I actually lean on the left hand side there, let him know I'm there, return the favor. And that's all that uh, he saw of me. We could breeze past him and get past that annoying driver. And you're almost certainly gonna come across this kind of driver in an arrive and drive session. But rather than getting frustrated, use this opportunity as a challenge and see what kind of tricks you have up your sleeve to try and get past him. Let me know in the comment section down below if you've encountered a similar incident and let me know how you got around the driver. But until the next video guys, keep karting and carry on.